Well, hey, listen, today is Boxing Day in Canada, so to all my Canadian friends and subscribers and followers, happy Boxing Day. Uh, I've been kind of lazy lately with packages that have arrived that I haven't opened yet, and I'm anxious to see some of these. Let's face it, I'm anxious to see all of these. Got the house to myself for a little bit here, so I figured maybe I could knock out a quick unboxing on Boxing Day. So, uh, Boxing Day unboxing. I really want to make this a short video, so right now I'm only going to open one. I figured this would be the cool way to do it. Each box you'll see is labeled with a piece of tape that has a number, and on top of each box I have a puck with a corresponding number. So I made up this fancy randomizer. Shake it up. And then we will dispense one puck. And that's the box that we will open. Maybe I didn't think this through. Oh, there we go. And we're going to open box number four, which I think is that one right there. It is. Let me move these things out of the way real quick, and uh, we'll get opening. Trying to remember what item this is uh, doesn't matter because uh, everything I bought is really cool, and I'm excited to add to the collection. Oh, yeah. This is pretty cool. You're going to like this. Okay, they're not in perfect condition. I knew that, but they are a really uh, custom, super hard to find colorway for sure. Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is pull that little wrist guard out. Uh, this has got the sewn in wrist guard. We're gonna end up cutting that out because those have that black fil uh, foam inside of them and it is disgusting. It breaks down over the years. There we go. Uh, we will have to get rid of that. These have not been used in a long time. Not sure I should be putting my hands in here before I clean these palms out, but we'll see. Wow, look at that. I'm guessing it'd be like Whaler's colors, right? Uh, white, blue, and green. Reactor 5 matching custom kit. There is no naming on them, but I do believe there was a point where uh, Canstar Cooper quit doing that on custom gloves. Right off the bat, I can see the, the binding on the blocker is uh, becoming unstitched. And up here, across here, and across here. That shouldn't be too difficult. I should be able to sew that back by hand without even taking it apart. Um, the palm is pretty solid. There's a hole in the finger there, the index finger. The wrist strap looks like it's, I don't know what's going on, like it was cut is what it is. So there should be a little longer piece on there that runs through a little flap, a little tab, and then wraps back around to itself. A uh, little bit of a wrinkle to it going on. Not sure if I'll be able to, or, or because it's custom, it's got a thinner board in it, or this has the like molded uh, foam shape. So it may be something to do with that causing it. Maybe that's a different size or something. I could probably add like a thin layer of foam to the top of that to fill in some of that space if I wanted to. Catch Glove has this extra um, leather strap. Well, I think that is not factory. Someone added that by cutting a slice in the, the backhand over flap there, right through the Velcro. Yeah, somebody added this little extra buckle strap here. I don't know what the need for that would be. There is some damage here on the uh, backhand cover, a little rip in the material there. That's got gray. That's got gray also. Is there gray on this blocker? There is gray on this blocker. So that's white, blue, green, and gray. That seems like it would be Whaler's colors then, eh? That's pretty darn cool. Um, do I have pads that match these? No, not at all. I have blue and white. I have green and white for the, uh, for the pond. Maybe these would be good for that. For uh, pond hockey, those those pads are really rough and not really um, in a position to be used for regular hockey. That needs to be re-laced uh, on the perimeter here. That shouldn't be too big of a deal. I mean, they're usable gloves. They're not perfect, but I'm pretty happy with that. So there we go. That's my Boxing Day unboxing. Thanks for watching.